Hello, my soul is here. I'm getting ready. All right, so if you saw my last video, you saw that I got a tattoo back in um, 2016, and I'm, I'm sure you guys have seen it, like, you know, in my videos, um, or if you follow me, like, on my socials. Um, but I wanted to talk to you guys about uh, before and after what you should uh, do and know when getting a, a tattoo. So I strongly recommend that you um, really do your research on the tattoo artist and place that you're going to go to. You want to make sure that this person and uh location you go to is credible you want, you want to make sure that the tattoo artist is certified um you want to make sure that you know you see their portfolio to see their work and see if you like it um um it also might help if you uh know someone who has uh, gone to them so i recommend you know seeing if that's possible um my first tattoo artist that I went to, uh, my cousin went to him, so I knew of him before, um, so that helped. Um, and also, like, you know, once you go uh, to get your tattoo, they should have you sign a, a form if they're responsible. And um, you want to make sure that, that you, you know, are very open and, and honest. Um, you want to make sure that, if, that you list any uh, medical history that they ask of or maybe that they don't ask of and you find it still important. Um, I personally had to share that I have a precaution on, on a latex allergy, so they used, um, you know, non-latex gloves on me. Um... And, um, yeah, you, you just also want, want, want to make sure that, you know, the, the, all the equipment they use is sterilized and they wear gloves. Um, and then after you get your tattoo, um, these, this is what they should tell you, but in case they don't for some reason, you want to make sure that you, you know, apply a very thin layer of ointment to your tattoo. Um, my second tattoo artist, uh, because I just got my tattoo retouched, um, he, uh, advised me to get vitamin A. A and D ointment, um, and I got this at Walgreens, um, and uh, I was also advised to get a non-scented cream, and I got um, Studio 35 Beauty Intensive Skin Repair Hand Cream. Um, I found it the first time that I got my tattoo originally, um, and I just liked it, <clears throat> so I recommend, you know, getting those two things. Um, and yeah, just, you know, wash it um, very well uh, with uh, antibacterial soap, your, your tattoo, and um yeah just take care of it and make sure it's really what you want to get because a tattoo is forever i know i know that they have like laser removal uh now for if to, if you want to not have your tattoo anymore but it's a long process from from what i've seen and tedious so just be sure that you what, what you have is really what you want for the rest of your life and um yeah make sure that what you get is really what you want and uh yeah, that's just my little advice on getting a tattoo. Um, good luck if any of you get um, get it. Um, I'd, love to, I'd love to see your guys' tattoo if you already have some. Tell me your experience. And um, I'll link below um, where I went to for both tattoos. Um, and um, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye!